Landscape architecture is experiencing the spaces and making positive impact on environment. The things we work with are people, of course, but we also work with a lot of kind of trees or plants to create better places for humans, but it can also be better places for insects or animals. We're doing research to find out why people feel happy. And if we figure that out, we can imply that into our design, because then we know specifically what makes people feel happy. So there's two specializations. There's urban design and landscape design. And I chose uh, landscape design because it's focused on a smaller scale. And I'm more into the smaller details that complete a unique design that can create better environments for people and animals. We have a lot of theory course, but most important for this program, uh, it's more like a practical stuff. One of our course is like you have to make an actual model. So like we will create a model one-to-one -one that people can actually use. I think it's really important because people have to use that. And when I saw people are actually like, you know, engage with my design, it's just, it feels so good. So for people who are thinking about applying for this study, it would be a good thing to know that it's a full-time study. We also have a lot of group work. You're never on your own, uh, but yeah, it's definitely something you should think about. If you don't like group work, you shouldn't study it. <laughs> <laughs> I chose to come to Denmark to study is because I heard Copenhagen create a really good strategy regarding of flooding. I think it's really nice strategy and I want to know how it actually works in Copenhagen. And that's part of the reason that I chose to study here. Yeah, so we have a lot of crises like stormwater management, uh, but also biodiversity crisis. So I see landscapes architects as a way to solve one of these huge uh, crises in Denmark and all over the world. <laughs>